Yo, what up, everybody? It's your boy Studio Gamer here, and we are back with some more Until Dawn. But before we get started, if you haven't already, go ahead and hit that subscribe button, ring that bell so you know if I whenever I upload new videos, which is multiple times every single day. And leave a like and comment down below. Let me know what you thought. Let's get into it. Chapter 8, Revelation. Three hours until dawn. Oh. One of those critters. Yep. Bum bum. Emily, 401. Sir, I don't know if we can go this way any. If there's anything this way, oh well. How far does this go? I don't know if we're supposed to go this way. I can't remember. So let's turn around and go back. I figure because of the camera angle, we're supposed to go the other direction, but. You can never really tell with these games. Yeah, I don't fucking know. Maybe we were supposed to go this way. Oh well. I feel like going back and forth trying to figure out which way we're supposed to go and which way we might have some hidden stuff. So we're just going to follow this. Oh shit. Fuck. <laughs> Almost hit the wrong fucking button. Oh shit. Alright. Oh, let's go right. I don't fucking know. Oh shit. Maybe not. Oh fuck. Well, damn. Uh, okay, I was about to say, is it working? Alright. God. My fucking heart's pumping. Oh god! I fucking set my controller down and shit. Wasn't fucking moving. I was about to fucking pull up my arms. Man. Bullshit. Oh shit. Oh shit. God. I missed the fucking button. Come on. Ooh. I almost fucked up. 
God. Fucking run. Don't just stop there. Oh shit. Did she just get fucking bit? God. Zip line this motherfucker. Better hold on, bitch. Oh, damn. She's getting all kinds of fucked up. Keep running. Exactly what happened. I am trying to tell you. We were climbing up the tower and it it fell. The whole tower just fell right into the mines. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What mines? There are these mine shafts all over running under everything. When the tower fell, we ended up down there. I don't understand. The tower fell? How'd it fall? There's something else. I found this little, like, it, it was almost like a camp with these marks on the wall and and this little broken wooden cross and it, it had. It had Beth's name on it. I think they fell down there, and, and I think Beth died from the fall. Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, God, poor Beth. Listen, in in the tower, there was there was a radio, and, and I got through to someone, but then that was right when the tower collapsed. Em, you made it. Oh, God, yeah, yeah, Mike. <sighs> what about Matt? We're trying to figure that out. Yeah, and then there was this monster that was chasing her. I, she's all messed up, guys. Emily? Hey, Em? Whoa. Who the fuck can that be? Josh. Jess? It's not Jess. Sorry, man, but who is it? I don't know. We should check it out. I got your back. Good. Door. You ready? Mm -hmm. You ready? Just do it already. Whoever it is is probably gone by now. I, I'm, I'm less you can fucking see them. No, no, no. I think that's less good. You do the door. <laughs> I got the gun. <laughs> Damn. Uh, Burst in. Hold on there. Hold on there, mister. Freeze. Oh, what? All right, all right. Just... Take it easy, Grandpa. <laughs> okay, everybody, just calm down. Now, just move over there. Go on, move. Let me say what I came to say. I'm here to tell you what you're up against being back on this mountain. You should never have returned. I don't know why you did after what happened last year. You mean with Hannah and Beth? Yeah, how could you know without being involved? Oh, responsible. You hold on to your horses. I don't take kindly to you kids coming up here to my mountain. Your mountain? Huh. I'm sure the Washingtons would be very surprised to hear that. <laughs> well, the mountain don't belong to me, it's true. But it don't belong to the Washingtons. This mountain belongs to the Wendigo. <laughs> Who? What's he talking about? The 
hell's a Wendigo? Let's hear him out. Not like we have a choice. I'm only gonna tell you this once. It doesn't matter to me if you believe it or not. I got reasons I wanna get it off my chest. See? I told you. He's guilty as shit. Guilty as something. Shut up, Mike. There is a curse that dwells in these mountains. Should any man or woman resort to cannibalism in these woods, the spirit of the Wendigo shall be unleashed. Oh, crap. You're gonna need to find somewhere safe. The basement might be okay. Okay, get down there now, all of you, and wait. What? Why? For how long? Until dawn. Guys, I ran off and left Josh when I heard screaming. Where did you leave him? In the shed. Uh, your friend will already be dead. No. No, no he can't be. I, we, we were just with him. A lot can happen quickly on this mountain. No. I'm gonna go get him. You can't go out there, Chris. I'm supposed to be his best friend, and, and, and I let him down. No, he let you down, Chris. He let all of us down. I don't care. I'm going to get him. Then I'll go with you. I, I don't need your help. Ain't going alone. Is suicide. Fine. The rest of you, get down to the basement. Be safe. And don't go outside again until we're back. You don't seem to understand the magnitude of the situation. Well, I'm going to get Josh, aren't I? No, I'm going to get Josh. You're going to help me. Do you understand? Uh, sure. Yeah, I think so. You need to follow me and do everything. I tell you. This is the end you point towards the thing you want to kill. I know how to use a shotgun, man. No, you don't. What? How do you know? <laughs> Trust me, I know. Hey, come back safe. Aww. We need to hurry, son. I, uh... Get a kiss you before you die. So, so, so tell me, you're the expert on these things. Uh, what's, uh... What, what, what's a guy gotta know? You just be careful. You follow my lead. Yeah. So, how many times do I have to shoot it with the shotgun before it's dead? Well, you've been shooting it a long time. Y you mean this thing won't even kill it? No, it'll slow it down. Well, how do you kill it? They don't like fire. I don't like fire. They fear it, and it can kill them if you have to. See, their skin is like, it's like tough armor, unless you burn it off first. It's gross. What are these things like? I mean, are they just crazy unpredictable, or... I mean, can you figure out what they're gonna do? Well, they adhere to some pattern. Like any animal. Or human. Well, you mean like how? Like they've got schedules? Well, they only hunt at night. Oh. Why? I didn't ask. Probably because they don't like the sun. Tips like if I rub garlic all over me, they won't be able to smell me or something. Uh, they'll still smell you. Anything like that. I can't see you if you're standing still. It's like toads. <laughs> Sight is based on changing the movement in their field. So if I don't move, I, I'm, I'm basically invisible. Yeah. Well, I wouldn't recommend testing it out. <laughs> No. Damn it, what happened? Oh, he's 
gone. We're too late. Shh. We gotta find Josh. He can still be out there. <laughs> First, the Wendigo. He'll render you immobile. And then he strips the skin off of your entire body, piece by piece. And again, he keeps you alive and aware and feasts on your organs, one piece at a time. So go watch that. Let's go now. Might still be near. Wait. No more. Go. What the fuck? God. I wasn't even holding the motherfucker. Some bitch. Yep. There it is. Take his flamethrower. Well, damn. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, yeah. Probably should have shot him. So the fucking flamethrower thing would have. Exploded, maybe. Bam! Oh shit! <laughs> Blast him right back into that fucking limb. Yeah. That didn't feel good, did it? Oh shit! Might not kill him, but it's fucking got some kick in it. I keep not shooting the fucking explosive ship. Come on now. Oh, thank God, please. Let me in quick. Oh, my God. Chris! Oh, my God, what happened? Yo, we gotta go. That thing was, like, right behind me. Go, 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 go! go. Oh, there's fucking Josh. Oh my god, guys, thank god. It took you so long. It's not so good up there right now. Understatement of the night. Chris, where's the flamethrower guy? Uh, yeah, he, uh... He got decapitated. What happened? The thing, it, uh... Yeah. Apart, right in front of me. Oh, god. All right, these are all the doors? Yeah. Are you sure? What are you looking for? Another way out. Mike, look, I really don't think that's a good idea. We should stay put right here until dawn. At least we're safe down here. Oh, yeah? All wrapped up like a little present with a bow on top? That thing to tear us apart on Christmas morning? People will come for us in the morning. You don't sound so sure. That is what'll happen, right, Em? Yeah, I, I mean, right? Well, you can wait. I'm leaving. Mike, there's no key for the cable car. Josh, he's got to have it. Josh? One of his dirty little tricks. Great, great. If that fucking thing got a hold of Josh, then we're shit out of luck. I don't know, Mike. It's possible. What's possible? It may have taken him down to the mine. What? I saw some horrible stuff down there. I think it's where that thing lives, and... Huh. M. What? Fuck it. I'm gonna get that key right from that thing's goddamn bedroom, and then I'm gonna get us all the hell out of here. And what is all that? So that old guy's bag. Is that a map? <gasps> that guy was prepared for anything. <laughs> Not quite. What is this place? Oh my god. Wait, wait, wait. What is that? I was down there. It was horrible. You were? Some of them survived, but. Like, 15 of them didn't make it. There was this reporter, and I think he figured out there had been some, like, big cover-up going on. I found these plans. They knew the mine was a death trap, but they let the miners keep working anyway. And I'm not sure what it means, but I found this chair. Dried blood all over the place, like somebody'd been tortured. 
Michael, I'd like to maybe focus on how we're gonna get the fuck out of here, please. I'm just saying, it's weird how much crazy shit's gone on up here. What's weird is that there's a tunnel leading from the lodge to the sanatorium, see? That's how I got back here. I saw this when I was down there. That's where it lives. Um. Um, what is... Huh? What is that? Ash. Um, oh my god, oh my god, it's, oh it's my god. It's nothing, it just it, oh no, it bit it, no, me and... It bit you? What bit you? The... The Wendigo. What? It's nothing, really. It's not a big deal. You okay? Shit. It doesn't hurt anymore, really. It's... It's not that bad. Em, if that thing bit you... I, I know what you're thinking, and I'm fine. Are you? Yes. Emily, at least let us check it out. Emily, if the Wendigo bit you, you could turn into one of those things. Oh, that's ridiculous. He said it was from eating each other. Remember, he said oh, that. Is that how it worked? Yes. It happens. If it bit you, you're going to turn into one, and then you're going to turn on us. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. <laughs> Here That's not how it works, people. What? Mike! You gotta go. If you, you resort kidding? to cannibalism, then you become one. Like hell I am. Emily, you can't stay here. Mike, just cool your head, okay? We don't know if it works like that. Maybe it's just a bite. I've seen what these fuckers can do. And I don't want to say it again. What is this? Guys, what are you doing? Door's right here. I am letting you do this voluntarily. Oh no, you're just making yourself feel better about sending me to my death since you know there's a Wendigo out there ready to rip me to pieces like it did with... Okay, oh my god, will you just go? Go, get out of here! Whoa, okay. Whoa, 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 Mike, calm down. You're... you're gonna shoot me? Mike, me? This is the safe room, Em. Please. It is not safe as long as you're in it. Not for us. Don't, don't do this! I'm really sorry. Man, I don't like her, but I'm trying to keep everybody alive. I don't want to kill her. Yeah. If we shot her, she would have died. I've done that before. Maybe. Trying to keep everybody alive. Fucking, we already lost Matt. Don't know where the fuck Jessica's at. Keep an eye on her. If you see anything weird, you guys know what to do. But I'm trying to keep everybody else alive. Yes. No one leave. Okay? It's not safe out there. I'll be back soon. That, that he was gonna help us. With a flamethrower, dude? Now we don't have a chance. No, guys, it just means we've gotta be tough. We've gotta do this on our own. I don't know if I can. What does it say? It says that the bites, it, if it bites you, it's not infectious. It doesn't do anything. Let me see uh, that. I'm sorry, what did you say? Ooh. Um, She'll be okay. It says what? She says you'll be okay, bitch. Fine. I'll let fine. you live. Michael almost shot me. Is that he fine? Didn't but he didn't. This bitch almost let him. Hey, that's not fair. She was they was scared. all going to let him. I'm the one who's scared. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Emily. I didn't know what was going to happen. There's none of us know. Sam there's might not no have, excuse. but... There's no excuse, Emily. Like, Ash and Chris were like, yeah, let's do this. I the palm of my hand, bitch. Oh. I. I'm sorry. I'm so, 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 so 
sorry. Shit. Shit, shit, shit. We've got to get the mic. Like now. We didn't get one of these last episode. Because of your choices, people have died. I don't know which is worse, actively triggering events that lead to someone's death, or passively allowing a tragedy to occur. Because you couldn't lift a goddamn finger to help someone else. Remember last year, huh? Are you left your poor sisters to die? You did nothing to help them. Paralyzed by your own self-centered fear. While a real threat was closing in. Now it's all about you, Josh. It's always all about you. Your game has gone terribly wrong. And your friends, like your sisters, have deserted you. You're all alone. Can you feel how cold your loneliness has become? Huh? Why did you hurt them? Joshua, why did you hurt them? Oh, but of course you did. They were your friends, you misled them, you lied to them, and you put them through a night of genuine horror. Let's hope that it's not too late for atonement. And that your friends, if they still are your friends, can save you from something worse than death itself. And that's going to be it for this episode. Hope you all enjoyed. If you haven't already, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Ring that bell so you get notified whenever I upload new videos, which is multiple times every single day. And leave a like and comment down below. Let me know what you thought. Till next time. Peace out. Yelly. Everybody love everybody.